points. I have skill point. I have three skills points. Uh, what's this? What's this do? Interesting. I'll do this one. Uh, and I'll do this one. How about that? I got one skill point, but I'll keep that for later. Up to Sarah. So. Are you ready to get to work? Yeah. Is there something else? Let's ask some more questions. We're explorers. Humanity has always hunted for knowledge in the unknown. We just take that a little more seriously than others. We were founded decades ago by a man named Sebastian Banks. He wanted a small group of people from all corners of the settled systems dedicated to the biggest question of all. What's out there? These artifacts could be everything we've been looking for. Another great secret the universe is asking us to unravel. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I don't know what you've heard, but I can imagine. First of all, I think you can dismiss any stories about us no longer existing. Hmm? I don't believe in smearing our name everywhere we can. Exploring the universe, charting the unknown, that's what counts. Besides, having a little mystery gives us I'm just kidding. <laughs> a kidding. A fixed reputation could fence us in a lot of ways. Uh, yeah. We're I'm ready. going to be doing some old fashioned detective work. The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. That means people can pass them around, not even knowing what they are. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually, but a tip from UC Vanguard sounds promising. Aha. Uh -huh. Good. A chance to learn about, more about the United Colonies. L legwork never pays off quite the way you expect it. Hmm. So this one. A volunteer force that helps defend the edges of United Colonies space. They're always looking for recruits. Ow. Lots of retired veterans and dangerous professionals mixed in with part-timers who barely have a laser cannon welded to a hull. My contact is in the recruiting office, so he hears a lot about what the volunteers are up to. We have to assume that we're not the only ones to have stumbled into this mystery. But most people aren't going into space looking for the unknown. They're looking for places to settle, mm -hmm. resource to extract, territory to defend. An odd looking rock or a single strange hunk of metal wouldn't mean much to them. That's why Constellation exists in a way. To put pieces like this together. Together. I need to stop. You've done this before, eh? Wise words. We watch each other's backs. We'll be fine. I've never done this before. It's not what? Just that. What did I just say? I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself, and for you to learn more about us. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. We'll be traveling together. I didn't sign up for this. Actually, there's something I want to do on my own. For no. What do I get out of this anyway? Constellations have a sa You mean besides the ship, the robot, and a place to stay all rent free? The fuck? We do have some funds we can disperse from time to time. Not to mention, I think we can get you a proper suit. Oh, that's we free? Explorers. We keep a lot of equipment on hand for that purpose. So the more you work with us, the more we can share what we have. Nah, I didn't, I didn't, hear, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't hear the part sharing. What, what do you mean sharing? Share, sharing. We'll need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. 
so long as we don't bring Nusi security to our doorstep. Every member of Constellation is their own conscience. Understood? Uh... Uh... What do you mean? Okay. Good. Let's take a little stroll through New Atlantis, shall we? Oh, I've already scrolled around New Atlantis, I... Wait, who is this looking around? What's over here? This is all exciting, but there's really a lot of pressure on us, isn't there? We need to make this right. Oh, she's following me. She's following me. Okay. Guess what? You you are walking a little slow. Sarah, come on. Jesus, you walk slow. Oh my god, that scared the living hell out of me. Uh... Are we going again? Where exactly are we going? Oh. What is, what is she doing? Walk like a normal person, dude. So, like, you don't walk like a normal person? Yeah, she's not going to walk like a normal person. I have no clue if I'm going the right way. Hold on. Wee! Oh, is that fall damage? Oh. To the vanguard. Now, you all have your assignments. Get out there and show them what the UC I've been takes. authorized to inform you that you are being transferred to the UC Vigilance. You will find out more when you get there. Other than that, I am not at liberty to divulge any additional. I'm with someone. Huh? Huh? Smart decision. Stand by to be transferred. What? Sarah, you know you just you're not gonna say anything. You're just gonna let me get arrested. Wow. Lazy. I'm telling you, the commander's got plans for this loser. Why else would he be going through all this trouble? I still don't understand why he trusts the criminal. Seems like too much of a risk. Criminal? I'm not a criminal. Whoa. The prisoner's ready, sir. I'm not a prisoner. I just got here. Is this about the thing that happened earlier? I literally am sorry. A little bit. I hope you're comfortable. We have a lot to discuss. I I don't I'm not, I'm broke. Who are you? Okay. Then. I'm your ticket out of the mess you've gotten yourself into. That's all you need to know for now. What mess did I got myself into? Hmm. Highly perceptive. Let me add that to your list of skills. Speaking of which, 
Let's see what we're working with here. <laughs> Seems you had a bit of a reckless past. Always fancied yourself as a wild one, eh? We can work with that. I also see that you mined on Vectera. And now you're with Constellation. You've certainly been quite busy. Oh, and look at that. Right at the bottom of this list is the criminal incident that landed you in my crosshairs. Oh, so this is like before, isn't it? It was the... Oh, well... Are you fucking kidding me? Now that we have that out of the way, let me introduce myself. A bitch? My name is Commander Kibwe Ikande, and I'm in charge of this operation for UC Sistev. Are you familiar with what we do? I honestly don't care, I'll be honest. Could you start by telling me what... <laughs> Can I just say I have sleep? Yeah. <laughs> uh. Yes, well, this is your only opportunity to keep yourself out of jail. So I suggest you change your attitude. Bitch, I'm not changing no damn attitude. Is a division of the UC Navy. Well, they handle the big picture stuff. We deal with a very particular problem. The Crimson Fleet. Uh-huh. So it has nothing to do with what I did earlier. Got it. On the books, they maintain combat ready space borne forces to deter aggression and ensure the safety of the United Colonies. Uh huh. So all that fancy claptrap means is that they're the ones who fight in the wars to keep our territory secure. I was with Sarah Morgan. If you can let me go, please, that'd be great. Smart decision. We've been prodding at the Crimson Fleet for years, trying to take them down one ship at a time. But we barely scratched the surface. If we can get someone on the inside, we have a shot at finding a loose thread we can pull to bring it all down. You want me to risk my neck and go undercover for you? That sounds personal. Maybe you should give up. Why can't the... I'm gonna go with this. It doesn't matter how I feel. I'm simply doing what's best for the security of the United Colonies. Look, I'm going to make this simple. Agree to work for UCC, Steph. Together, we take down the Crimson Fleet. And I tell these guys to throw you into the nearest lockup. Might even pack on an extra few hundred credits to your fine. Excuse you? It, you can't get away with that. This when you broke the law, you forfeited your rights. What law that I broke? Find someone else. What, 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 what happens if I go if I go to jail though? But you know if it. You aren't leaving until I have an answer. Oh my fucking god! Okay, well. Bro, I was I was with. Was this a plot? Was this a plot?
Because where's Sarah? Arrested, searched, and thrown in a cell. Not my idea of a good time. We need to talk to John T. System death is now your enemy. Of course they are. In mast. Hurry back. No wait, I want to talk to you. It's you and me from here out. I don't I think it's time we went to our supper. Wait, no, let's not do that. Do you mind if I ask you a personal question? Ask whatever you'd like. Yes, I need a personal question about that dude. Exploration is my entire life. I consider it oh. both a career and That's a the question. That being said, I will make a confession, but you have to promise to keep it between us. Before I graduated from school, I was in a band. I could tell. And no, I don't mean the school okay. band. Mm. I mean a rock band. We called ourselves Ironic Comet. <laughs> A ridiculous name, I know, but uh, we were just a bunch of teenagers getting together and having fun. And before you are, this is not the quite, this is not singer. what I was want. We actually played the drums. Oh, the really? Never really went so do I. Drums, but those were good times, and I remember them fondly. I played the drums too. Uh, again, that, that that's not the question I was trying to ask for. What do you consider your era? Expertise? You mean apart from being the chair of Constellation for the past five years? Well, let's see. I pride myself with my aptitude for astrodynamics, calculating optimal trajectories for grab jumping. That's been quite useful in the past. And as far as planetary exploration, my area of expertise is botany. So don't worry. I won't let you eat anything that might put you in the hospital. <laughs> uh-huh. My parents considered themselves to be enlightened. Enlightened? But their lives were so busy, they rarely pursued their beliefs. Mm -hmm. By the time I was old enough to start questioning these things, the idea of following any organized religion was almost an afterthought. Mm -hmm. It's not that I don't want to believe in anything. It's that my scientific mind is often at odds with my spiritual center having been out there in the star field seeing all those magnificent wonders with my own eyes i need answers not religious theory i'm sorry if that disappoints you nah, don't worry i'm good while we're on this journey together i fully intend to respect your religious views. i don't i don't really have one i mean not in game but yeah I hope you got something out of that. I did. I guess. All right, let's go. Yeah, seriously, let's get let's go. Uh, let's get out of this fucking place. Oh, you're you're in my way, actually. <laughs> Keep on the straight and narrow. There won't be anything to worry about. It's always nice to kick back at the broken sphere after a long day. Who's this guy? Sergeant Booth at your service. If you have a security related concern, bring it up to me. Is there a lot of crime? Okay. Not if I've got anything to say about it. For real though, I don't know if it's because everyone's too busy working or if it's because of the military presence, but crime's pretty low. We get the occasional drunken brawl, petty thefts and stuff, but Sidonia ain't exactly a hotbed of crime. We're not neon. Is that with me? As much as someone's last name is a nickname, friends, acquaintances, and other locals call me Booth. You can call me Sergeant Booth. Sure. Don't let me keep you. I I don't think you would want to keep me, cause you know I'm not that. Not I'm not, I, I'm not you know I'm not someone you would want to be interested in. At this moment, I guess we go this way. Okay. Sorry. What's your real name? It's no work. Yeah, do you have any idea how far? Oh, wait. I think that's where we're supposed to go. 
Oh, I'm so dumb. Okay. Get out of here. Let's get out of. Let's get out of Sarah. I mean Sarah. I said Sarah. What the fuck? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh wait, hold on. I need- Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Inventory. Much better. Ooh. Where are we? Oh, are you are you with me? I'm not used to you with the uh, with the helm. I mean. The shit. I don't know what I don't know how you call it. What a lovely view of the Martian sky. Frankly, I'm a bit surprised to find such a delightful spot in this rock. Oh, city. She's coming with me in the ship. Wait, is she yep, she's with me. What the fuck? Okay. Ah oh, fuck. I can't I can't. We're gonna copy what copying her. Cause why not? Where? I guess I'm the one who's running the ship and she's not coming with me for no some reason. They can keep me company, you know? I mean, I guess she's in the ship, but like, damn, come on. Where are we going? Uh... But of course. Where exactly are we going? I have no idea. Do 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 All that nonsense for no reason. Ah, shit. Where's, uh... Where'd she go? Interesting. She's not here. Oh, well. Oh, there she is. Are we supposed to enter here? Confused. Maybe he's there. Yep. The well's been having brownouts all the time. Yep, yep. Sarah. Uh, another space explorer. Hey, you ever think of joining up with a vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? I got arrested. This is no time for me to be talking about these things. United Colonies volunteer fleet. Independent captains enlist, get to use their own ships, and the UC provides them with sustained work and credits. And put in your time, and you're guaranteed UC citizenship and everything that comes with it. 
discounts on UC goods and medical services, a chance to own a place in New Atlantis. Only way a foreign captain could even dream of seeing those sorts of benefits. So, you want in? Uh... All right, all right. Can't blame me for trying, right? I mean, I still haven't given up on getting Sarah to re-enlist. It's a game we play. He asks. I say no. Here's what I got for you two. <laughs> okay. Van it's a good Garth game, I guess. the name of Moera. Helped patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system? Which admiral did he upset to get that post in? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. A scientific discovery being used as a... Oh, he goes way back. I think it was recruit number 81 or something. Uh, okay, that was. Are you kidding? Lowest posting request rate in the whole fleet. Only thing there the UC cares about is Mars. And no one wants to go to Mars. They want to get off Mars. Okay. Soul system is a lot of planets. But a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. Yeah, bring a coloring book. You get so used to seeing red, you'll forget what blues and greens look like. <laughs> I could do with that. You'll have to ask him. The Vanguard volunteers have retrieval rights if they get into a scrap. Wouldn't be surprised if he found it off of a pirate or something like that. Hmm. Good point. Anything for Sarah. UC always takes care of itself. What do you mean anything for Sarah? How about me? Children. I'm here too, you know. No, brother. I'm serious about that recruitment offer, by the way. You just come talk to me when you're ready. UC is a good friend to have. Okay. I'll come back. I'll come back after this this journey. Where do I go? Where where do we go now? Speak to the commander Chola about joining the me right now? Am I already here or something? Good. Is it? Is it? Is that underneath? Is there something underneath us? Oh. Yes, there is. Come on, Sarah. Jesus. I cannot do that to myself. Also. Why is she not taking it with me? Weird. Okay. I've flown across most of the settled systems in all Where the you didn't even get in there. How do you get how do you came here? Interesting. You are a mysterious woman. Ah, oh, I've always liked that statue. It's beautiful, isn't it? What statue? There's no statue over here. I wonder what the artist was trying to represent. Is it this? I don't know. Uh, you know what? Yeah, it, it's fine. It looks cool. Damn, it's so dark. Security scanners, chemical sniffers. Hmm. The United Colonies sure isn't taking any chances. I like how we're taking my ship again, just. That's funny.
Let's go. Oh, wait. Let's grab this. Might not be Jennison, but this ship is starting to feel like home. I mean, it is your home. Because we're together. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Oh, wait. Do, do you have any questions? Here, I have something for you. <gasps> what is it? What is it? <laughs> oh, you're incorrigible. I picked it up on one of our latest planetary expeditions. I'm more than just an extra gun, you know. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Stop. You make me blush, Shara. Stop. <laughs> Gift wrapped it. Got a little excessive. I appreciate the effort. As long as it's not slowing you down, what does that mean? Damn, that's crazy. I'm just pleased I get to utilize some of my old field collecting skills. It's been a while. Check back with me from time to time after you return from our planetary jaunts. If I pick anything up, it's all yours. Damn, yes, I get stuff for free. Cool. She's like a sugar mama. <laughs> okay. And... I don't know where we're going. I'll be honest. But, we're lift off. So long, Atlantis.